What's your first seven days working on a new script? Well, before I write anything, I just think about it a ton, and I and I really make sure that I feel like I have the arc of the story and the characters, and I know where things are going roughly. Um, but I, you know, once I have that and I decide that I'm going to take the time and, and write this thing, um, the first seven days honestly are just writing feverishly in a row without ever looking back so that I don't have a chance to, to destroy the idea before it has a chance to live. That's really what it's about. Do you do composites of these characters? I mean, do you also do a whole write-up on this person's life from birth to middle age or whatever, even without putting that in the script, but that you fully know that character? Um, Sometimes we do composites of characters or we'll just think about backstory. But honestly, the story comes first because I think part of writing a story is, is figuring out who these people are. And at least for me, uh, the people are not necessarily that well defined. You may find that the story needs to go in a different direction and that that character that you originally thought of might not do this. Um, so to me, the story arcs and the and the plotting of the story is also is malleable as well as the characters are like everything is this tornado that unfolds and then once that first draft comes up back you kind of look back and then you start figuring out hey I thought this character was really like my sister but it's not actually it's like a blend between my sister and you know this this girl that I dated or whatever it may be so I think you know I just try and leave it open but once we're ready to shoot we we know who these people are and can probably talk about them for a long time. Any tips on figuring out the ending? It seems to be sometimes mm -hmm. a very difficult thing. People have a great finish, great middle. Um, I find endings to be easy. <laughs> I do. They tell it tells me the story tells me how it wants to end. The characters tell me what needs to happen. I think the hardest part for me is the middle. Is like you know, creating, you know, a situation that has real conflict and real confusion and real stuff to work through that's not, that's not just cute or convenient for, for a script, you know. Have you researched any of the, quote, gurus? Are you fans of certain screenwriting teachers' school of thought? I don't. I don't uh, subscribe to screenwriting gurus because most of them have not written great screenplays. Uh, I do, I do love uh, *The War of Art*. That's the one book that I love. Stephen Pressfield. Yeah, because, and I don't think it's a coincidence that he's a good screenwriter. Um, <laughs> he's one of the few who is, a, you know, has really um, written great things. Um, but to me, it's, it's. It's not about form and it's not about teaching you how to do it. It's really more about inspiring you, you know, and getting you unstuck. And I think that that book has been super helpful to me.